Did you know that the smallest mammal in the world weighs less than 2 grams? Additionally, there are several tiny creatures like a frog that can fit on a coin, a dog that you can carry in your pocket, or a small but lethal jellyfish that may surprise you. In case you are not familiar with these creatures yet, you will be amazed. In this video, I will showcase these and other smallest animals on the planet that are hard to believe exist. Let's get started. The Smallest Frog Let's shift our focus from mammals to amphibians. The Guinean micro frog, Pedophrine amalensis, stands out among all the species. It was discovered only in 2012, and it's not surprising. These frogs bear more resemblance to insects and even make sounds similar to them. Moreover, they hide under foliage, making them difficult to find. Scientists discovered the species by chance, and they were amazed when they realized they had found microhylid frogs. These tiny creatures are no more than 0.3 inches long and can easily fit on a coin. They live in the dense leaf litter of rainforests and feed on the tiniest insects. Unfortunately, the tiny frogs are often consumed by scorpions and many local invertebrates. Kitty's Hog-Nosed Bat And here's the main contender for the title of the smallest creature in the world of mammals. It's the Kitty's Hog-Nosed Bat, often compared to the Etruscan Shrew. Many believe that this animal is the smallest mammal, and even the Guinness Book of World Records agrees. This bat weighs slightly more than the Etruscan Shrew, around 0.07 ounces, but it's shorter in length at 1.1 inches. This creature does not grow to one and a half inches in length. Not without reason, this animal is sometimes called the bumblebee bat because, in terms of size, it's more like a real insect than a mammal. This tiny creature lives in Thailand and Myanmar. These bats spend their days in the depths of small caves and in the twilight, they fly out to hunt in groups of four to five primarily targeting insects similar in size to themselves. Etruscan Shrew A couple of centuries ago, scientists believed that a mammal weighing less than 2.5 grams couldn't survive because there were no conditions for normal metabolism in such a small body. However, in 1822, they discovered a species of the Etruscan Shrew that changed their opinion. This microscopic creature is considered to be the smallest living mammal although some may dispute this title. The Etruscan shrew is only one to one and a half inches in length and weighs no more than 0.05 ounces. Yet, it is a full-fledged mammal. It moves very quickly and sleeps only a couple of hours a day. The Etruscan shrew eats almost constantly during the day, consuming food three to six times more than its own weight. This animal, which looks somewhat like a mole, feeds on insects, small invertebrates, and sometimes even frogs and lizards. Interestingly, the Etruscan shrew is useful for forestry and agriculture as it destroys insect pests. This is a case where we can say, little pigeons can carry great messages. World's smallest fish. Meet Paedocypris progenetica, simply put, the tiniest fish in the world. It may look like an ordinary fry, but it's actually an adult, full-grown fish from the carp family. Larger carps would laugh at their Indonesian tiny relatives because they barely reach 0.3 inches in length. To maintain its tiny size, this microfish has shed many of the attributes of adult fish. Its torso is translucent, and its head skeleton is so small that it leaves the brain completely unprotected. In addition, females can carry only a few eggs, and the male reproductive organ is so small that it's capable of fertilizing each egg individually. Irukandji jellyfish. The Irukandji jellyfish has a beautiful name and elegant appearance, with a small bell that is about 0.7 inches wide and four thin tentacles that are only a few millimeters long. However, these tentacles can sometimes grow up to 3.2 feet long. Despite its small size, the Irukandji jellyfish is incredibly dangerous. It belongs to the class of insidious box jellyfish, and its venom can cause the Irukandji syndrome, which is dangerous not only to sea creatures but also to humans. The syndrome manifests itself in unpleasant symptoms such as pain throughout the body, nausea, tachycardia, and pulmonary edema. The venom has a delayed action so symptoms can appear a few days after the sting. 
It's a reminder that size does not always matter. Royal Antelope Antelopes are some of the most famous animals in Africa, but also some of the most unlucky ones because they're hunted by lions, eagles, hyenas, and so on. While the common antelope is a good dinner for an African predator, the royal antelope is more like sunflower seeds or chips. It's hard to even believe that this is a real antelope and not another animal. It's only 10 to 12 inches tall and weighs 3 to 7.7 pounds. The calf of the royal antelope is so small that it could fit in the palm of an adult's hand. This species is found in the dense forests of West Africa, from Sierra Leone to Ghana. Royal antelopes are cautious and vigilant, mostly active at night, as a predator could devour such a little creature in no time at all. It's funny that this species is called royal. Ninth sarcasm. Brookies Inanna. There are some reptiles in the world that are impressively large, such as giant anacondas, Komodo dragons, and saltwater crocodiles. They are so massive that they wouldn't even notice if Brachysia nana, their antipode relative, got into their mouths. This species of chameleon is less than 1.1 inches long, making it extremely difficult to spot in general. It's called the smallest reptile species in the world and can only be found in Madagascar. Interestingly, this minuscule reptile was only discovered in 2021, which makes it a very new species. At first, scientists were skeptical about their eyes and doubted the maturity of the chameleons found due to their tiny size. However, a microcomputer tomography of the reptiles cleared up their doubts and revealed this unique and remarkable creature to the world. World's smallest dog. Antelopes and chameleons are cool, of course, but what about more familiar animals, for example dogs? I don't think it's a secret that the chihuahua breed is very small. Such dogs can even be carried in purses, but even among such tiny ones, there are record breakers of their own. This is Miracle Millie, a Chihuahua from Puerto Rico who got into the Guinness Book of World Records as the world's smallest dog. She's 3.8 inches tall and weighs about 0.8 pounds. In the pictures, you can see how tiny the dog is. Even things like a sneaker, a ball, or a bottle seem big compared to her, and this is a full-grown adult. Her owner, Vanessa, says when Millie was just born, she could fit in a teaspoon, and she had to be fed from a pipette because of her size. She couldn't eat the usual way herself. Vanessa's very fond of Millie and often takes pictures of her, but she admits that there are disadvantages to such a record breaker. Vanessa has to watch her feet all the time in order to not literally crush her pet, and on walks, Millie often gets lost, even in low grass. Western Pygmy Marmoset in the dense forests of South America, a tiny monkey lives among the exotic specimens high up in the foliage. The western pygmy marmoset is the smallest monkey in the world, weighing just over 0.2 pounds and growing to about 6 inches in length. However, it's important to note that this title belongs to the mouse lemurs from Madagascar and not the smallest primate. Despite its small size, the western pygmy marmoset is agile, and can jump through trees in search of food plants, fruit, and insects. It hides inconspicuously behind tree trunks and branches, like a chameleon, and jumps like a squirrel. The monkey's long tail, usually longer than its body, helps it keep balance while jumping. Although not tenacious, the monkey can still eat worms in zoos. In comparison, huge gorillas and chimpanzees would have laughed at their tiny relative, as the western pygmy marmoset can fit easily in the hand of an adult. Barbados Thread Snake Speaking of worms, take a look at this. It looks like an ordinary worm good for fishing, doesn't it? But in fact, it's not a worm, it's a snake. Yes, it's the Barbados Thread Snake from the island of Barbados. This species is less than 3.9 inches long, so it's not surprising that the snake has the appearance of a worm, but it's not a dangerous snake. However, it is dangerous only for its prey, termites, and ant larvae. For humans, the snake is not dangerous, but most of the Barbados thread snake will pose for the camera, lying on a coin. By the way, these reptiles have one more interesting feature. Apart from length, because of the miniature size, the female lays only one egg, but a large one. The length of the hatchling is 1.9 inches, 
which is half the length of the mother, but for snakes of this size, this is normal. It's the law of nature. Smaller the snake, the larger the offspring. This strategy allows the babies to come into the world as prepared for life as possible. Scientists believe that if their body length were shorter, they simply wouldn't be able to find food of a suitable size. Be hummingbird. And finally, let's talk about the animal you've probably been waiting for, the bee hummingbird. This is the smallest bird on the planet, and while many people know about it, there are many interesting facts to learn. For instance, bee hummingbirds weigh only 0.07 ounces and are 1.9 to 2.3 inches in length. They also have a frantic heart rhythm, with their heart beating up to 500 times per minute. Not only that, but their wings beat more than 90 times per second, allowing them to hover over flowers and drink nectar. Speaking of nectar, the bee hummingbird consumes about 0.07 to 0.08 ounces of it per day, which is equal to its own weight. Additionally, hummingbirds are the only birds in the world that can fly backward. One final fact that many people don't know is that these tiny birds can only be found in Cuba. So there you have it, all you need to know about the fascinating bee hummingbird. Let me know in the comments which tiny creatures from the video surprised you the most. Thank you for watching and see you soon.